are turned in here tonight. That is what they will be. EA Sports. It's in the game. So here he is, one of the more prolific takedown artists in the UFC at present. And when you get some praise from Daniel Cormier, when it comes to your offensive takedown game, you know you're doing something right. And we talk about wrestlers and judo players and grapplers, but this guy just combines all of that. He is able to use foot sweeps from the grappling game. He is able to use throws from judo, and he's able to use wrestling in the, from the wrestling game to take people down. He has an array of takedowns at his disposal, and he uses every single one of them from the speed of the level change to the timing to the knowledge of where to go next when the guy starts to defend, he's truly, truly something special. I don't think he could take you down, but tonight he doesn't have to. So in this to. matchup, prevailing wisdom is he'll be able to get this fight to the canvas. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven foot Kareem at Jafar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So these fighters relatively close in age, just a year apart, and they both possess a similar height and reach. And with the official Ladies introductions, here is the veteran is voice of the Octagon, the Bruce Buck. The evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. If you just look, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 127 pounds. Fighting out of Olympia, Washington, Dynamite. And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. advantage on paper when you're a striker at this guy's level that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has well perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there nice kick landed by this gentleman big and kick all right throws a straight punch and lands so that is increasingly becoming an effective weapon for him tonight this is one of his best strikes, and he's throwing it over and over again. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Body kick lands right under the elbow. Back 
back to the jab now, no good. Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Trying to double up on that jab. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. He's got the turtle in that kick. Wow, actually got the takedown. Perfect execution as he gets the single leg takedown. Well, you're starting to see the damage now bleeding from his cheek. All right, well, he's got him softened up here. Back to his feet. Nice body kick right under the elbow. And they separate. Nice punch lands over the top. Ooh, head kick lands. Hurt. Straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Big knee there. That was a jab. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by a muscle. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Left chain to the leg, finish the takedown. Great job. Oh, nice. Oh, he might have got it with the choke. Wow. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Just unable to quite find that range. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Can't take many of those, you better check. Just missed with the left there. Oh, and now he lands the knee. I'm not sure his opponent saw that coming. He didn't see it coming because he does such a great job of just throwing. He doesn't have any tell when he's going to throw it. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. A lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Nice kick. Oh, Superman punch! Oh, nice right hand. Oh, nice job to block the kick. Sneaky head kick. Lee's cut is getting worse. The cut man chomping at the bit to get in there. He'll have to wait for the break between rounds if we get there.
Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard every time you see him drive his shins into his opponent. But he needs to check one of these kicks. He has to discourage him from throwing this kick over and over again. Powerful leg kick land. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round he has found the rhythm and found his striking range scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two nice defense there huge block So you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't wanna mess around for too long. A lot of top pressure being applied here. Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. All right, working inside the closed guard now. This is no safe place against this opponent. Well, you know I don't like the gi very much, but I have an appreciation and a healthy one for these type of transitions. You can tell he's been in a gi at some point in his life with the way that he moves so freely. I'm skipping jujitsu next week, too. <laughs> Oh, setting up the left hook, but out of range. Nice head kick. Big kick land. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Trying to kick the leg out. Head kick is blocked. Ooh, what a punch. Beautiful body kick. Single collar tie now. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. with that jab attempt there. Oh, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. And both guys really throwing with authority. That strike blocked by Lee. Look at him drive his shit. Oh, and there's the double leg takedown for him. Beautiful entry there. Spinning back fist. Ten minutes in the book. That horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are gonna be... Oh, what a nice lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick, 
Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Goes to the his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. It was high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Wow, what a head kick. Oh, big knee. Just misses there with the left. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Big kick land. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Man, doesn't take a lot of these kicks to produce redness. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Nice strike. Take a head kick like this. That is such a tough even be on his feet right now. All right, close guard now. You gotta be careful though. He's got a lot of submissions off his back. Lands with the ground and pound. Back to the feet. Man, this is some serious ground and pound here, DC. He's not just staying busy for the sake of staying busy. These strikes are doing damage. Oh yeah, no pity pat to this guy. This guy's trying to land, and he's trying to land effective strikes. Crazy accuracy and efficiency with these ground and pound strikes here. And if you're the opponent, you got to intelligently defend or the referee's going to stop. You got to defend. But you can see him now start the game posture and the intensity at which he's throwing these ground strikes is starting to improve. It's starting to elevate because he knows that he can get the finish. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Oh, just misses with the kick. Massive head kick. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Just out of range with that kick attempt. Oh, the fight thus far. How's his opponent still stand? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Oh, that's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be... Whoa! He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Man, what a fight. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Good punch, Lance. Stuffs the takedown without issue. And a nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind it real well. He lands a switch knee. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a over the top. This fight's going to be over. This. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh, that's a nice strike. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round.
All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. Next round is now underway. DC, nice any match. major takeaways right. after the previous five minutes? That both these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put these two in the opposite. Even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high-level mixed martial arts. Unable to connect there. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's... Maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg. Nice kick. jab, follows it up with a nice right hand. Over and over, he lands a big body kick. Look at him whip his hip into that game. Oh, that's a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Now goes in and secures the takedown. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. You got to be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Oh, man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here. Nice punch. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by Lee. Well, you see all the grappling repetitions here. Just beautiful movement, seamless transitions on them. Over and over, these guys are doing things that you see in every jiu-jitsu gym around the country. Nice punch, Lynn. All combination lands, and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. He's so accurate when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. You gotta check these low leg kicks. We march on three minutes to go. And that left hook landed on the button. Well, he has certainly kept the punch counters busy tonight. He's landed a ton of significant strikes and clearly is winning this fight tonight. He's winning this fight going away, and it's one of the rare instances where everything comes together. Ooh, what a punch. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Look at the angle of that knife. Oh, man, man, look at that one body shot. Did that show the power? And the power and the placement. It was placed perfectly, and now he's got his corner. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Right under the elbow. Straight punch lands. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Oh man, look at that. Picture perfect. Got to the leg, got to his position, got another beautiful takedown. Nice head. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got a pressure. Chase that finish down now. Who oh, blocks that kick to the body? Nicely done. It's such a fast leg kick. Out of range with that one. Final minute. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw this right until he makes it. Stop throwing. Oh, huge block! 
try to establish that jab. His opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize him as the guy, and now he's got him hurt bad. Look at the force behind Whoa! that leg kick. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Ten seconds to go in round four. He's looking to land the right just out of range. Entertaining scrap so far. All right, that's the end of five minutes. That's the end of the round. You see the cut on his lip, and that thing is only getting worse. Pretty nasty gash at this point in time. You know he's going to need some sutures after the fact. The focus right now, though, keeping his head in the game. Don't think about the cut. You got to think about getting your offense going and shoring up that defense to prevent that cut from getting any worse. All right, so a huge round for him there. That head kick probably would have had me out for good. The guy survives to see another round. Yeah, but he'll go back to that. It landed so perfectly. He set it up great. He did a great job of mixing up the target early, going up high, and getting the desired result. Fifth and final round. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh! Massive kick to the head. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Whoa! Big diving punch lands. Keeping busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Oh, man, that cut looks terrible. He's bleeding like crazy. I wouldn't be surprised if they stopped the fight with that cut at some point. Back to the feet now. Big kick. Nice body. Oh, single collar tie here. Big leg kick land. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Switching stances here. Way to hide that leg. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Kick to the body by Lee. Well, the body was wow. Oh, no. Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. All right, DC, no Telestrator tonight, but we're going to get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moments, you got to show up. And that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called us off for this contest at one minute, 49 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee! So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result tonight as he gets the win by knockout. He spoke it into existence. He said over and over to anyone that'll listen, I am going to knock this man out. He did it in an even more impressive fashion.